What's up everybody? This is Missy from Lansing Hoops and today I am going to show you how to collapse and open up a collapsible uh, two connection hula hoop. Uh, so this is a regular infinity hula hoop well, with two connections, uh, one on each side. So to collapse a hoop like this, it's very simple. You put one connection on the floor in front of you and the other connection at the top of the hoop by your belly button. Very gently put your foot on the connection on the bottom, not so that you're bending the hoop, just to hold the hoop still. And each hand will go on either side of the connection on top. When you do this, you'll gently push forward with one hand while you pull back with the other hand. I like to push with my right and pull with my left. And it will twist down into a figure eight. After you get it into this position, all you do is push the hoop together like this and you have two circles and then all you have to do is push one of the circles inside of the other one so that the hoop stays in a circle like this. Uh, and then you can easily uh, carry this to transport, put it in a car, take it on uh, an airplane, or go somewhere else where you don't have a lot of space. A couple things to remember is uh, that if the hoop has been coiled like this for a long period of time, when you open it up, you do wanna make sure that you let it sit for a little while, open up flat on the floor, preferably in a warm area, so that it can regain the correct shape before you start hooping with it. Otherwise, uh, it might end up being a little bit uh, wonky. Uh, the other thing that you wanna remember is that when you open it up, uh, you just wanna be very gentle, so you just push the one hoop back through the other side, turn it over, and very gently reopen that figure eight shape. So when you do that, you'll know whether or not you're opening the right way because there will be resistance uh, if it's not if you're not doing it the right way. So it should be very easy to open it up. If it's not, uh, try opening it in the other direction. Whatever you do, don't force it uh, because uh, you don't want to warp your hoop. Once you get to the figure eight, all you have to do is just slowly twist the hoop open like this and then you might just need to adjust the connections a little bit just so that the hoop uh, is circle again. I like to just push the connections together when I'm done just to make sure that there's a tight fit. Probably fine if you don't do that, but I do, like I said, just to be on the safe side. Last thing to remember with a collapsible hula hoop like this is that you do not want to store it in the collapsed position. It may be tempting to coil it up every time you're done with it and store it on a shelf or under your bed, uh, but it will warp your hoop over time if you leave it stored like that. So the best way to keep it uh, in the best shape is just in a big circle like this until you are uh, ready to travel or take it on the road or whatever it is that you're going to do. So that is, uh, like I said, very simple tutorial for how to collapse and open up an infinity style collapsible hula hoop without warping it. Hope you have a great day. If you want any more tutorials like this, head on over to LansingHoops.com, get signed up for our newsletter, and I'll deliver them straight to your inbox. Talk to you later.